Look, 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 look at this. Somebody come look at this. Look at this. Somebody come and look at this. You weird, buddy. What in the blue gravy biscuits are you doing? Don't worry about what I'm doing. All right, what's up, my Cypher gang? If you're new to the channel, go by the name two times. You call me Zeta Who. Welcome back to the channel. First and foremost, I feel like I ain't been back here in a minute. Like, it's because it's bright right here. It's the sun. But um, if this is your first time ever clicking my video, my name is Two Times. You call me Zay. Welcome to this family. Make sure you join the family by subscribing. But first and foremost, I just want to say, I feel great because we've been going through this Minecraft series, bro. I've been feeling it. I said before, the best thing about being a content creator, you're the person behind it and creating everything that you do. The edits, the music, the memes, everything. You're in control over that. So it's like... I wanna post whenever I want, you know? And it's like, I've been being consistent. I've been feeling uploading lately. I've been trying to get back towards on who myself is. Like, yes, I've been taking a break and taking my time throughout all this, but at the end of the day, it's where you go back to square one on where your roots to begin on where you wanna get your, you know, the flow, your consistency, you know, all that energy back. So, um, today, what was I about to talk about? Golden air. I'm in my 20s, man. I feel like just from my opinion on what I've been through, what my experience is, it's like, you're I'm 20, right? What? Keep in mind, I'm 21 going on 22 in a month because my boo, bro, it's a freaking that, bro, boo. No! I'm going on 22 less than a month. October 27th is my birthday, but I feel like you're 20, when you turn 20, I feel like that's your golden era as far as everything that you want for your future and what you strive for yourself and what you want or what you want your family or what you want your spouse to want. Regardless and I, I said this and I was talking to my brother, Lord willingly, if it, if it ever was to happen, you know, like 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29. So that's be 29. When you turn 20 and 29, those are not only 20 is your beginning stages, your golden era, but 29 is how you finish off will determine how you and your future for the rest of your life, how will play. My goal was to, you know, I, there's still anything can happen in these 12 months. Anything can happen in the one month. Anything can happen in a week. If you had that in mind, I plan on not working for the rest of my life that's where my head is at like mentally yes i'm still young and i got a lot of work to do out the mud i got a lot of work to do but at the end of the day my mindset if you put in the work if you keep praying for it if you keep asking if it's lord willing he will do it for you it's not just a step back regardless on the whole process on what you go through and anything that you put your mind to there is never going to be a perfect pass nothing is going to be perfect nothing is going to be hard the closest thing we had to perfect is when he left which is jesus christ that's the only thing that's perfect image only thing that's perfect in the flesh but anything that you put your mind to when it comes towards gold it's gonna be bumpy roads through it all it's called life but if you pick your faith in the right one which is jesus christ yes he didn't say it was gonna be easy but he never said he was gonna leave you he was always gonna be with you throughout the struggles throughout the darkest moments of your life and all include me i've been through i've been through a, a dark path i've been through dark places in my past like like I said before, nine months ago was really when I hit rock bottom through everything, not just situation wise, not just feeling defeated in a soul, but I wasn't placed where I wanted to be in life. And I felt like for me being out this, you know, out this, out of here, when I got my escape route, he told me not, he told me to go and not come back. He told me don't look back. That's what he told me. Because at the end of the day, the older you get, the older you start to understand things. Oh, you, you know, part of me i think about you know it's in my mind i think about a lot of things i'm pretty sure people think about a lot of themselves and things when they're not around hence i'm an introvert i don't like people i don't like this world that is a common fact and it's not supposed to be in my heart but i can be honest enough to say i don't like people i don't like this world. in my heart i don't because people are weird i'm not saying in general but hence on why i don't have friends my community is my friends, okay? I talk to y'all. Y'all know who y'all are. But just in general, why I'm an introvert and like a homebody, 
it's too much bad stuff that's going on in this world already to the point that we cannot do anything about it. The moment that sin was in this world is that's when nothing we are have in our control. Yes, we're born in it and yet, you know, unfortunately, it's not our fault. But at the end of the day, if you got the power to do it, stop it. So it's like, you know, when people get into a certain life, like far as personally for me, from my personal experiences, like I said, this is an opinionated video. This ain't facts. Like you free to click off if you want to. It's just my opinion about things. Like from growing up, from having childhoods, from, you know, I did all my things, dance outside, backyards, being kids, field trips, all of it. I did it all. Watch Nickelodeon, SpongeBob, Zoe 101, Drake and Jobs, Rugrats, Foster and Imaginary. Like, I watched all the, like, kids next door. Like, I feel like, regardless of not, and sometimes that, like I said, I wish this is that, that I was born in the earlier times. Screw 19, screw 18. If I was able to be one of Jesus' disciples, just being in the presence of him, honestly, I feel like my life will be great because not only I had the perfect image in the flesh, but he left me with something and things that I can do to progress my life and everything. You can't do that now. Like, this world has fallen off so bad. This world, Ooh. I'm gonna kill this gnat, bro. Go ahead, go on about your business, Ooh. bro. Damn. I just feel like, in my opinion, it's just things just, it's just it's too late. So it's like, I don't have time to argue. I don't have time to be feeling angry about things. I mean, other than my mistakes, because that's what God made us, that came us down here to do was a choice. You got to learn from your mistakes. It's a certain amount of things that you have to do to the only person that's in control of it is you. You'll get tired of it. So mentally, you'll do something about it because our flesh or our bodies does not respond to us unless up there our brain everything that we is controlling our body so you got to do what you got to do to turn your situation around like regardless or not i'm gonna be mean i ain't got nothing to show far as i'm not a flexor or anything i'm very <laughs> quiet on my life private on my life i'm grateful for what i have you know i'm not out here you know i don't have a lot i have enough to me that i'm grateful to let me know that regardless or not it's not about how many things you have it's not how many it's about to be honest the bigger picture about everything is not only number one is having a relationship with jesus but also fixing yourself because a lot of us have issues and things that we're not proud of doing and sin things but it's all on how you encounter those problems like you gotta face them one day regardless you can't keep being in the same bubble and thinking things are gonna change you gotta step out so you just gotta do it you just gotta do it I feel like i've been down here in a minute but 20s you gotta grind like all jokes aside like i'm 21 going on 22 and you know sometimes i don't give myself enough credit on what i do but i know for a fact i still haven't felt like i've done enough in my life yet like i'm not satisfied it's not a bad thing it's just you want more for yourself if anything that's the hunger that you need the fuel that you need but don't forget everything that you get just know if you make it to the top or anything that you always wanted and everything you know thank god for it. yeah that glory to him because regardless of not breathing vessels that's in sin into this world i'm breathing today making this video i'm up today lord willingly because he chose to wake me up today like that's regardless that we don't want to accept the fact that we're born in sin and we do sinful things and more satanic devilish things this this, and that but i know in my heart I don't want to serve him. I know in my heart I want Jesus to have my soul and serve him. Like, I don't want to serve the devil. Yes, I may do some action, some satanic devil things, but regardless or not, I don't want to serve that because what is really this world? Like, yeah, you can have all the money in the world. Like, don't get me wrong. It's not so much the money on me and why I want to break up, like, break out of this and make this YouTube stuff my stuff. Like, it's not about that. It's more of a legacy thing for me. Like, I already know now, like, I have enough videos. Like, I made a lot of videos, like, when I was little. From when I, It's been a journey for this channel. So, it's kind of like that's where I'm at in my YouTube golden era right now. Because not even YouTube golden era. This is my golden era. 20s. 20s is important. 20s is important. Because that's not only when you get to learn things. 
you get to grow up and you get to learn from experiences on why things happen to you when you was a preteen child when you was going into these eras like i always think of the situations of you know what i've been through and what i'm facing on an everyday basis because the fives you know you think back on certain things on what god tell you like just because God tells you no does not mean it's a bad thing. Like, it's good that he said no because something could have happened in a time where he didn't want you to be. Like, believe it or not, man, God be protecting us. Like, he be protecting us in ways that we don't know. Like, did he close doors that don't sometimes sometimes some closed doors is perfect because you know he may not want you to go into those but don't think of it a situation and it don't mean that's not gonna be a blessing around. The storm is heavy, but you're gonna get through it. But lot it's a lot you got to do it's a lot of work but it's worth it you know it, 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 it ain't for everybody trust me like i my mentality you know it's i'm i'm chilling right now but i'm i'm active but i'm that's where my head is at it's not just so much of me doing this because it's my purpose it's my dream not purpose but it's my dream you know god gives you the purpose so ask for it you know if I can do this and spread the word and do my things at the same time, spread the word. I'm going to do it. So, it's mine. Damn! Damn! Okay. I'm thirsty. But, um, let's get it together. Don't be worried about other people. Do what you gotta do. The only person you should be in competition with is yourself. You sh it should be you against you. You gotta learn the best version of yourself. The best version of yourself is a disciplined man. A disciplined man is the most powerful man because not only set himself aside to be doing so many wicked things and things that you shouldn't be doing, but he disciplined himself. Well, we all should be in on the competition with ourselves. I want better for myself. I do. I want better. Cause you can't keep living in this world with the same stuff. Get out your circle. Get out your comfort zone. It ain't so bad. So I'm trying to think on what I want to do. Cause I'm gonna edit this video. Most majority of the time it's gonna be. I hope I have it out before work. But I'm um, trying to think on the next thing I want to create. Cause I'm probably gonna make some more Minecraft. I've been feeling it lately, and I've been having. I gotta have more episodes. Like the next episode of Minecraft that I'm gonna have is gonna be longer. Like, cause just having these 14 and 17 minute ones, it's because of the stores. I gotta buy more stores. So for a fact, I know I ain't forget about Geometry Dash. Listen, I know once we get back, Lightning Rod. But once we get back, I'm not clicking them gauntlets. I gotta warm up. I haven't been on Geometry Dash since I stopped uploading it. Geometry Dash coming back, and we gotta get some new games. I'm thinking about streaming, which I mean, I don't have my camera right now, but I gotta find it. But even if I do, I'm just gonna stream. Why not? So. Love y'all. This me and boy two times. Make sure y'all join the family by subscribing. We out.